hello everyone welcome back to gloria glitz tv in today's video i decided to share with you guys how to prepare one of Ghanaian favorite street snacks called kele wele when you walk on the street in ghana at night you see most people selling this kele wele and you will be hungry for it when you perceive the aroma they also use this kele wele to relax after eating their dinner so I have eaten it a couple of times, it is very delicious and it's also very easy to prepare. So I decided to share with you guys how to prepare it. If you are new in my channel or you are just watching me for the first time, thanks for watching. After watching, please subscribe to support Gloria Glenn TV. And do not forget to turn on the notification bell so that whenever I upload any new video, you will be among the first person that will be notified. To my returning subscribers, Thank you for always coming to watch, like, and comment on my video. If you have been watching me and you have not yet subscribed, subscribe to support Gloria Glenn TV. Without wasting your time, let's get started. I will be using ripe plantain, onions, ginger, slim pepper, I will be using pepper flakes, black pepper, I will be using alligator pepper, nutmeg, and salt that's all i'm going to be using so let's go for the preparation when preparing kele wele use ripe plantain that is not very ripe so that your plantain will not melt inside the oil so what i'm going to be doing now i'm going to peel out the skin of the ripe plantain and cut the plantain in two before slicing it in a small size I'm going to cut the plantain in two and slice it to this shape that you are seeing right now so feel free to slice it to your desired shape but this is just the perfect shape for Kelly Wille so I'm going to be repeating the same process for the rest of the plantain as you can see I am done slicing all the plantain so i'm going to keep it aside this is how it look let's go for the next step for the next step i am going to be blending all the pepper soup spice that i showed you earlier feel free to also use blended pepper soup spice they are all the same Okay, I am done blending and it is very, very small, so I'm going to be setting it aside. I just cut these onions in two behind the camera. So I'll be using a quarter of these onions and I will slice it in a small size so it will be easy for me to smash later. This is ginger, so I'll be smashing the ginger so that it will be very smooth. As you can see, the ginger is very smooth, so I'll be adding pepper flakes and also add the pepper soup pie that I blended earlier, so I'll keep smashing. You can also use blender to blend everything together if you can avoid adding water so that your kele wele will not be watery. So I am going to be adding the sliced onion that I sliced earlier and also add a little bit of salt and keep smashing. If you don't have pepper flakes, you can also use this long red pepper or you can also use cut bonnet. It's all the same. It's just for the kele wele to be spicy. Kele wele has to be very spicy. So I am done smashing and this is how it looks. So I'm going to be adding black pepper to the sliced plantain together with the spices that we blend earlier. So I'll mix it properly together and keep it aside to rest for about 5 minutes. Make sure it is well seasoned or it is properly mixed just the way you are seeing it right now. So this is how it looks. I'll be keeping it aside for about 5 minutes before frying. Subscribe! Subscribe, subscribe to Gloria Glee TV. Subscribe, 
Make sure your vegetable oil is very, very hot before adding your kale willy. When frying, fry on a medium heat and do not stir immediately. Stir it after 2 or 3 minutes so that the seasoning will stick to the kale willy. So this is after 2 minutes of frying, I will stir it and allow it to fry more. It is ready guys, this kele wele is really really enjoyable. While you are relaxing eating your kele wele, you can top it up with red wine or with white wine or with juice. You will really enjoy it, try it out you are gonna enjoy it. If you are still here watching this video, thanks for watching. If you enjoy watching this video, give me a huge thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I upload every Thursday and Sunday. See you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.